And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here in the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and England defender, Lee Dixon. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. I certainly can't wait for this, Lee. Good evening. What a pleasure it is to be here with you, Derek, sitting over this magnificent stadium with arguably the best two teams, well, obviously the best two teams in this competition this year because they're in the final. And what a final we've got. The pitch looks fantastic. The crowd are expectant. There's the trophy just sitting there and the players are in the tunnel just about to do what they do best, go out and play and entertain us. Extremely sloppy in possession. Well, many have remarked upon the hosts and their preferred style, which is one of high pressing and trying to get the ball back quickly. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yes, Derek, high pressing is their game, but there is a risk attached to it. If the opposition break through that press early on, you can be left vulnerable at the back. Careless in possession. It looks promising. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, they get the ball once more. Can he finish? Simple save, really. Ferguson and there to intervene Hedges fruitful looking attack losing possession here and the danger clear Edges, Watkins, promising attack this, might be a chance here, well that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well he's had an absolute nightmare there, the goal's in front of him, just hit it. And this is it, the final of the UEFA Champions League. It's where everyone wants to be. Only two sides can accomplish that feat. And Lee might jump in front. What an opportunity it was to score the first goal of the match. Well, I'm not sure he'll get a better chance than that old game. It really is a bad miss. Bruno Lech has it. Pedersen. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Able to get his body in the way. Breaking at pace. Well, it could be on for him here. Still a chance. It's in! The first goal of the Champions League final. Oh, it's a fantastic moment. What a moment for the players. And what a moment for those supporters. Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Oh, 
Not the pass he had in mind. And he did well to cut it out. Edges. Ross McCrory. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Can they get in behind them? That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Got to it easily, the keeper. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Christian Grindheim. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. The build-up has been intense, and now we're just about ready to go. Make no mistake, the world is watching. It's the Conmebol Libertadores final. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. You can guarantee we're in for something special. It's Atletico Paranaense, and they take on America de Cali. Well, throw the form books out the window. This is a final. It's about the day. It's about who settles first. Calm thought process, game plan. With all that noise going on, good luck. Difficult to stop him. The attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Can someone get on the end of this? He might yet finish. An alert piece of defending. Rafael Carrasco looks promising this they've won back possession a clear twitchiness following the high press and a throw coming up oh nice ball John Arias 
And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. And the ball's gone. It's opening up for them. And he might be through here. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Over it comes. Well, as a defender, that will suit you down to the ground. He cuts it back and delivers towards the back post. And clears the danger. And possession given away. Crossing opportunity. Well, the moment he would dearly love to have back. Well, listen, he's tried to hit it too hard. Just relax a little bit, focus on your technique. Well, you know, Lee, if we'd been covering this tournament a couple of years ago, we'd have been covering it on the basis of two legs in the final. 2019, it was changed to one final, one match at a predetermined venue, Lima in that case, when Flamengo beat Riva. Yeah, absolutely, and that's how finals should be. Just the one game, none of that two-legged nonsense. And I'm really pleased it's like that now. We're in for a really good game. I love finals, you know that, Derek. Fruitful looking attack. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. So tight this game. Who's going to break the deadlock? Be brave, be a hero, take chances. Can they take the lead here? Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. And firing it into the area. Not to be this time. Well, that is how to play advantage. Couldn't keep it. Adrian Ramos. Chance to play it in. It's given him something to contemplate. Surely it's still alive. And in the end, no damage done. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match.
Gentlemen, it's your boy True back again for EA Sports. We're literally seconds away from kickoff. So come on, people, get off your seats and show your team some love. Time to get cracking.